very clear that is uh, while dealing with Putin, that's a paranoid dictator who is uh, staying in power for eight years, and as every dictator, um, he, he always reacts to failing economy with uh, uh, geopolitical aggression. Um, and uh, naturally, looking at the map of uh, the nations, mostly, of course, Estonia and Latvia, they just have border with, with uh, main Russian territory. Which is not, not the best, best uh, uh, place to locate man massive troops. Uh, um, uh, they should, they should uh, be concerned. But I doubt that we are looking for any uh, serious actions on this front. Because um, Crimea is a uh, story. There was a base of Sevastopol, and also there was a fact of surprise. So the surprise attack um, and the massive Russian population that uh, that expected, you know, that's expected dividends from joining Russia. Everyone in Latvia and Estonia was a considerable amount of Russian population living in, 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 in compact uh, 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 regions uh, like Norway, Estonia. The, 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 the mood is very different. Plus, uh, there will be obviously um, um, uh, uh, strong resistance, um, whether from Estonia or Latvian side, uh, which will require full, full scale invasion. Invade NATO countries, especially with American troops, NATO troops stationed there. It doesn't look like Putin. Because if you look at his record, he's a KGB guy who always looks for a war of clandestine uh, operations. He's not a military dictator who is willing to start being confrontation, recognizing that the Russian army is not a Soviet army, and it's just confrontation with NATO and lethal. So I would look for other directions. For instance, I would look for, for him doing maybe something in uh, uh, Georgia, in, in, in the Asian region. Maybe in the reinstating war in Ukraine, in Eastern Ukraine, but I, again, I doubt very, very much since it's, it could be extremely costly for him. So it's the, um, I think we'll, he'll, he'll continue uh, underground operations to undermine Western democracy as he has been doing. Uh, yeah, election in Germany is, 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 na is na national target, is all the everything to undermine Angela Merkel, the chance to be re elected, though he is losing this ground. And of course, he'll continue uh, running borders in the Middle East, and maybe Libya, that's another another potential target. Okay, okay so that's it. Thank, thank you, you thank you so much. much.